Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna show you guys what I did for Brooklyn's DIY Minnie Mouse birthday, and this stuff is really affordable. We did a small birthday this time, but I'll show you guys. That was a plate of the ears. I ordered those off Amazon. They were like $12.99 for a big bundle. Here are some of the gift bags. I just did mini bubbles. Play-Doh and Play-Doh cutters and then little mini snacks inside of those. Um, this That three sign is a sign that I had and I just wrote a three on there. We covered a box um, with black tissue paper and then just put some mini um, decals on it. Over here, this is the Not So Hot Chocolate Station. I pre-put marshmallows and um, chocolate mix in there and each kid gets their own jar. These are the plate of snacks, so some mini snacks, pouches and such, but that is my tablescape. We were just waiting for me to make more bags and for my mother-in-law to bring the cupcakes. And then over here I did it really simple, just a little um, balloon area and then this is where all her gifts are gonna go and I just dressed her little stuffed animal up and then that little sign, happy birthday, was made on the Cricut. And then we're going to go into the kitchen for the grown-ups. This is kind of the bar area. We had waters and juice in the refrigerator for the younger children. Like I said, this was a very small um, party for her. Um, here, the grown-ups can grab their glasses. And then on the other side, this is where the food's gonna go and I just put a few more of those um, confetti pieces there. And then there we have all of the plates and cups and forks and that kind of stuff. So I am in the garage and it is raining. Um, I wanted to show you guys inside the garage and what we have going on. It is raining, that's why we had to bring things inside, but I'll show you like the little setup that I did very, very, very last minute out here and how it looks. Very garage looking, but we have this tunnel here that goes around and then in there. We have like balloons on the floor, like it's really colorful in here. This is kind of the Play-Doh station for the kiddos. So we have Play-Doh and that. And then this is the sensory station over here. So we have um, those little water beads. And then that's our little sensory area. It has duckies and all of this kind of stuff for them to play with. And then this area over here is just a little color station. And um, I thought three or four kids could sit here at a time. I could rip out the pages and then they can just do some coloring. So that is our little setup in the garage for Brooklyn's birthday. And unfortunately we had to bring it in because it was raining, but I tried to make do what I had. I think it'll be good for the kids. How do you feel? Are you excited? How old is Brooklyn turning? I'm two. No, how are you gonna turn in two weeks? You're gonna be three. Yeah. Are you waiting for your friends? Yeah. 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 We're waiting for Grammy to bring the cupcakes. You're waiting? Can you look at me, say hi, wave at mommy. Turn around this way. Look at, say hi. Yeah, you're a bear. Yeah. So I wanna thank you guys so much for watching this quick little video of Brooklyn's DIY birthday party. I hope you liked all the mini inspired stuff that I had inside and then how I zoned our garage outside so the kids can have a good time. Um, we're doing a smaller party this year, like I said, so not very many kiddos, but um, I think they will have fun. Um, thank you guys again for watching. If you enjoyed this video over Cricut, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and I will see everybody on my next one. Bye.